Hello everyone, my name is Kichiko and this is a, a new video or another video of 13 uh, Sentinels Aegis Rim. So this time we're going to be starting off with a Sekigahara. So let's get started. know who I am, don't you? That's why you've been following me. Of course I do. You can't escape us, eh, Sekigahara? Sekigahara? What do you want from me? Tell me! <sighs> Guess you have a death wish. Wait! It's because... you came from another dimension. Another dimension? Enough with the games. Tell me the truth. Resistance is futile. Surrender now or else. If you won't answer my questions, then talking to you is what's futile. Ooh, he's a robot? Or is that a stun gun? Another dimension. Could that really be true? Even if it is, there's no way I'd be able to tell. My memories, they're gone. Phaser, hey, Seki Gahara. It's no use, I can't remember anything. But that's what he called me. It has to mean something. Hey, Seki Gahara. That name doesn't sound familiar, but it apparently belongs to me. Phaser. I should have two or three shots left if I can serve power. This gun does feel a bit out of the ordinary. Could it really be from another dimension? As long as it's set to stun, it won't kill anybody. Mm. But it's strange. Why do I know how to use this? Have no idea. Good. He's still alive. I made sure to set it to stun, not kill. Just who are these guys? Men in black, duh. Check belongings. Hmm. Maybe he has something on him that'll give me a clue. Just a pair of handcuffs in his pocket. And... Some old communication device? It's huge. Walkie talkie? All he has left on him is his wallet. You won't mind if I borrow these, will you? No. Take them. Okay, so... I'd better not use this here. Its range looks to be only one or two kilometers. That means his little friends can't be too far. If I mess with it now, they'll know I'm nearby. An outdated transceiver for communication purposes. It has a very limited range. Nothing in here but cash. Might as well put it to good use. I mean, it's a wallet. I haven't eaten a thing in two days, after all. Hang on. This is strange. The designs on these bills look completely different. There's even a 500 yen bill. Aren't those out of print? And these coins are from back in the Showa era. Public transit is too risky. It's likely under surveillance. It might be safest to travel along the river. But before that, I should really get something to eat. Two days ago, I woke up in that alley. My memory's gone. Since then, I've been on the run non-stop. Wait. I w wanted to examine the... What? Where am I? Oh, it's... How did Horimura. I here? Sensei. I can't remember anything. What is this? Some kind of... 
kind of gun? Why would I have something like this? Is this thing real? Why would I be carrying a weapon? Everything is a complete blank. Why am I here? I don't even remember my own name. Is this thing real? Why would I be carrying a... Hey, miss. Are you okay? <gasps> she isn't breathing. Did you stun her? I wonder... What happened here? That's no use. I still can't remember anything. <gasps> Is it possible that... I did this? Looks like she's bleeding from the abdomen. Based on this evidence, the gun appears to be the most likely cause of death. Did you kill Miss Morimura? No! Is it possible this woman and I know each other? All I know is I woke up next to her with a gun in my hand. Was I the one who killed her? Where I woke up. Did I miss anything? Pills? It's highly likely these belong to me. All right. I should see if that woman has anything useful on her. It might serve as a clue to what happened here. Oral NM C0204 is printed on the label. The bottle's made of plastic. There's nothing inside. Oral and there's something in her skirt pocket. A piece of paper with numbers written on it. Are there any other clues around here? The note says four four three six eight five three two one four. What could it mean? A password of some sort? She has nothing else on her. There's nothing else here. Oh. I haven't checked my own pockets yet. Let's see. An ID card. A student ID to be specific. And... A key. But to what? appears to be someone else's student ID. Sakura High School, Class 1B. Iori Fuyusaka. Oh! Fuyusaka. That's when he bumped into her. Her face does look familiar. But I can't remember how I know her. You it's bumped uncanny, into her. Though. Or Almost she bumped like into you. To me. Rushing to school. In one way or another. It's a student ID from Sakura High School. It appears to belong to a female student. Iori Fuyusaka, Class 1B. There's an emblem on it. Maybe it's a car key? here could it have something to do with that woman whatever's inside seems to have stayed dry there's nothing written on the envelope some documents are inside there's a note and what looks like a personnel file inside Chihiro Morimura occupation teacher there are instructions written on the note 
If capture is not possible, then shoot to kill. Chihiro Morimura, 31. Sakura High School nurse. One year older than me. member of Shikishima's weapon development team. Chihiro Morimura, 31. Chihiro Mori... A note that was included with the files on Morimura. It says, if capture is not possible, then shoot to kill. A note that... Chihiro Morimura... Chihiro Morimura. There's no doubt about it. That's who this woman is. Well, was. Can I get that lad ladder? This is the place. Let's uh -oh. see what we can find. Someone's coming. I won't be able to talk my way out of this one. I need to get out of here before they see me. Check down this back alley, too. Oh, they've got me surrounded. I need to hide. What a Man in black. Where'd that boy run off to? He has a gun. We best proceed with caution. We're authorized to use deadly force if necessary. Yes. We need to clean this up quickly. If he gets away again, we're in deep shit. Let's contact HQ and tell them more on it. I'll leave that to you. We'll monitor public transits. He can't have gone far. Sounds like I'm the one they're after. And that means... I must be their culprit. Why can't I remember? No time for that now. I can't let myself be captured. At least until I figure this all out for myself. What do I do now? Oh, this scene is so if beautiful I don't get too. My memories back. What'll happen to me? Hey. What's up? leather wallet there are a few bills and coins inside no credit cards though Chihiro Morimura the one I found dead a note that did I kill her did someone order me to do it yes did you Need something? You stick out like a sore thumb in this part of town. Get yourself somewhere with lots of people. I still don't know how they do it. But they're able to track your general location. Wait, who are you? The man in black? I'm here to return the package I borrowed from you. A package? Yeah, I left it over there. Hmm, okay. Is that E.T.? I don't understand. Who are you? Do you know me? I'm not here for small talk. Coming here at all was risky enough as it is. Just go get your package. I don't understand. <laughs> See ya. Oh, bye. 
girl said this belongs to me? E.T. Hello. I can't imagine how seeing this must make you feel. Forgive me for the theatrics. I didn't have much choice. I'm sure you've noticed by now. My name is A. Sekigahara. I'm you. If everything went according to plan, then I'm talking to myself, but with no memories. We don't have much time. So I'm only telling you what you need to know. This is not your world. You're a human from another dimension. This place you're in right now, your stay here was intended to be temporary. But there was an accident. A very grave one. And now many people are unable to return home. I... Well, you are stuck here as well. <sighs> mm. But don't give up yet. There's still a way back. Unfortunately, I can't tell you here. You understand now, don't you? If they see this recording, they'll know. So I've hidden the information you need elsewhere. Its location is known only to me. You must find it. And don't get caught. If you do, there'll be no escape. You have to trust me. Trust yourself. I only hope you make the right choice. Bye, E.T. Slash Wally. How am I supposed to believe all that? Still, it does line up with what those men in black were saying. First things first, I need to get out of here. If what that girl said is true, then I'm not safe here. Which two files obtained? Five. Event archives obtained? Three. Close results. Episode seven. Number nineteen. Commence movement. May twenty-seventh, five twenty-one p.m. The scout units picking up multiple sentinels. Some are even fighting. Hey, Itayama. Takatoshi san, so it was you. No matter the war, it's an honor to fight at your side. Shinonome-kun, you deployed without permission from the Shikishima facility? It's my sentinel, isn't it? Another it looks like she's with bandages. Quite a party here. Did I miss an invitation? Sekigahara? And why are you in that sentinel? As long as it's functional, does it matter? I didn't come here for more of Sekigahara's flim flam. I'm going back to the front lines. Wait, stay in position. If any one of us tries to do this alone, we lose any chance we have at victory. Fine. So you call the shots. You're the only one here with command experience. We will split into teams, individually prioritizing attack and defense. The assault team will include Sekigahara, Shinonome, Karabe, Hijiyama, Miura, and myself. The rest of you will defend the terminal until Aegis activates. Operation Aegis. We're really doing this, huh? We're short on firepower and time. We'll need every trick, every weapon in our arsenal. Right? Victory condition, activate Aegis or destroy all kaiju. And then we lose if the terminal is destroyed or any pilot is killed. Alrighty then, which we know that the pilots are killed if we have to repair one of our sentinels and they are killed in an explosion. Battle start. Uh, victory condition, the time remaining until the sub dispense system Aegis activates is displayed on the top of top of the screen. Okay. Clear the stage by either protecting the terminal until the system activates or destroy the enemies until their assault ends. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, 
Okay, hold on. So many, gosh darn. Here we go. Did I get it? Threat suppressed. There you go. The this place is is unbelievable. I'm acting like an amateur. Second. I guess life comes at you fast. Okay, here's the plan. I'll stop them. Hit. That's my win. The practice round's over. These are fighter units. Uh, let's see. Anti air defensive flares. I don't think so. Unbelievable. I'm acting like an amateur. Hit confirmed. Hit. The practice round's over.
our plan. Torpedo too far away. Always think ahead. Number twenty two advancing. What's optimal? I'll stop them. That easy. I won't back down. What's our plan? Where are they? Number 19, commence movement.
What's the plan? Take this. That work? <laughs> Termination of enemy signals confirmed. Beginning of the end. Battle style select. Select the battle style that best suits you. This can be changed at any time. So casual eases battles for those who want to enjoy the story. And even balance between battles and stories. Tough battles for those who want a serious fight. I always do normal. Most selection unlocked. Play through the story in remembrance. Engage in battles and destruction and review events in lore and analysis. Okay. What? Hold on, let me save. Um Okay, so destruction, control the sentinels, and face a crisis at on. Remembrance, walk along fragments of the past through the eyes of the 13 protagonists. Analysis, look back on the truth revealed so far. Protagonist selection unlocked. Remembering stories diverse based on the actions you take. Seek out new paths to reveal more of the story. Alrighty then. Chart. Okay. Alright, so let's just go back to the very beginning. So, Judo Kurabe. So, if I want to fight. Okay. Hmm. Just an ordinary, ordinary day, walking home from school as usual, to a giant robot appears. Flow chart. Open the flow chart with tri wait, square to view the protagonist's story paths. You can resume a story from events with blue checkpoints. Amiguchi-kun's not the most responsible. That movie's a hidden gem. She always... Come to think of it, I saw shiba -kun in a dream the other day. A pretty creepy one. Something about an android. Bad news, Juro. Amiguchi's gone missing again. Eddie's at the cafeteria. Get ready to head over. Are you thinking of crashing his place again? Why not? Oh yeah, almost forgot. I never finished reading this. Come to think of it. She always seems to... That movie's a... Amiguchi Kun. Hold on. So... Crash room after school. So there's three paths that I can potentially take. Shall we go home together? Oh, 
I forgot I had a flyer in there. One for the Dimos movie. A sci-fi movie from night. <laughs> Sorry, Miwa-chan. It's okay. I'll go home by myself. Crap. Is that this I week's issue? Going. Yep. Last week was a real cliffhanger. I'm dying to know what too. happens. See you, Miwa-chan. Later. Well then, Bye. allow me to explain. After all hell breaks loose, the main character just... I guess it's about that shit. Stop time. right there. No spoilers. Word, and you're going on my shit list. Yeah. Fuyasaka-san. I notice she always leaves during break time. And? What about it? I'm just wondering where she goes all the time. Judging from what the other girls have been saying, she runs off to the nurse's office to take a nap. Oh. She's sleeping? What? You want to follow her to bed? Ah, come on, quit it. Okay, it's not the one you were looking for, but <laughs> I found a little something else you've been wanting to see. You know, that hardcore foreign movie? Don't make it sound so creepy. It's just a sci-fi flick. I also taped the next episode of that drama series. The one where the alien runs away to Earth. Hmm. Runs away Is that to the Earth. one where he teleports from the UFO to the bridge? Uh, oh. You've seen it already? The push from the... I don't really remember mm. watching it, but... I don't know. Maybe I did. The Visitor from Another World. In that movie, an alien's UFO breaks down. So he runs away to take refuge on Earth. There's a famous scene where he teleports onto a bridge. Um, wait, I'm not sure of which one they're referencing. We can't go to his place every single day. What if we're annoying him? Then let him be annoyed. I still get to play his games. Remember the original Daimos movie I mentioned? Mighty Kaiju Daimos? They're showing it at the theater right now. Wanna go see it? Isn't that the crappy old theater by Tsutsuji Station? Yes. I'd rather rent it on video. Then we can watch it on Amiguchi's big TV. Cheaper, too. While I was taping that show, I remembered something else. I totally forgot last week. They were airing UFO Wars on TV. I can't believe I missed it. UFO Wars, consider. Released in 1977, this was the first in a hit series from the United States. It's a dramatic sci-fi adventure taking place in a galaxy far, far away. Its popularity holds strong no matter how much time passes. Star Wars? <laughs> you guys are killing me. I actually taped UFO Wars myself. Wanna borrow it? Oh, I'm in luck! The quality's not that great, though. I recorded it in EP mode. Jeez, get your hands on some better tapes. Gucci Kun's house? Whoops. This is no time to be reading comics, huh? Right. Let's head to the cafeteria. If we're too slow, we'll lose him. Let's hit.
Enter hallway. What's up with the yucky soba pond lately? They're always sold the out. Area. That's the long way around. Shitloads of them. Let's use the other stairway. I like how he runs. Not here either, huh? Well, crap. So much for gaming today. Think the girls might know where he is? Maybe. I've seen him somewhere. I know you were eavesdropping earlier. You know, Kisaragi and the others. Did they mention him? Uh, I don't know. Guess we're out of options. Let's just go home. Huh? Oh, Juro kun Hi, Minami san. Minami. Uh, Talk to me. What's up? Well, uh, you know, about that guy. I'm just wondering how long he's planning to stay over. Ah, right. About that. Um. What guy? He's got a lot going on, you know. If you could let him stay a bit longer, I'd appreciate it. Oh, do you mean you're the best? Et. I mean Bj. Oh, would you look at the time? I've got to go. Let's talk later, okay? Bye. What's with your face, dude? Who's that chick? Me, not me. My neighbor. My grandma's pretty close with her family. You're looking pretty close yourself. What are you trying to this... imply? This is a serious issue at home. I was supposed to have this free time to myself. Ah, so much for that. Issues at home. Recall? Ever since that day, my life's been turned upside down. Rent one even Kurabe house dinner uh, table. Guess I fell asleep. Mm, smells good. That looks so good. Dinner's almost ready. Could you get the chopsticks? Oh, hey, is that, um, I'm terrible at names. I don't know if this is where the chopsticks are. Turn off TV. Oh, turn off TV. I fell asleep with the TV on. Thanks. Go ahead and place them at the table. She probably didn't realize it, but these are matching chopsticks, like for a married couple. Oh, I think she realized. Makes me feel even more awkward. She probably. That looks amazing. I usually just eat out or pick up pastries on my way home. Haven't had a home cooked meal in quite a while. It looks so we good. Go. I'm hungry. <laughs> it's like we're newlyweds or something. Okay, no. I'm not following that train of thought. I need to come up with a way to kick her out. You gotta kick her out? 
Dinner's ready. Shall we start? You have bags under your eyes. It's because you stay up late watching movies every night. No, I don't. You need to get to bed early. We're the same age. Stop acting like you're my mom. Besides, I can't fall asleep even if I wanted to. Oh? Why not? Well, because... You're here. Me? Have I done something wrong? Yet. No. Come on. We're a boy and a girl. Alone together. Puberty exists. Uh, are you trying to torture me? Puberty exists. <laughs> hey. Uh, we really shouldn't be living together like this. Are you afraid of someone finding out? Well, that's part of it. Anyway, I want you out of here by next month. Ooh, you're just if kicking you her say out. So. Jeez. Someone's here. Hide. Jeez. What a meanie. Jiro kun are you home? Minami san. Couldn't you have knocked first? Oh, Come she just rang the doorbell and just came right boys. on in. We're neighbors. Think I don't know my way around the place? Anyway, I've got a favor to ask. Mm-hmm. Is it about BJ? Oh my god. Juro kun I didn't know you cooked. I didn't. <laughs> it's called magic. So, uh, what's this favor you need? The favor is... Oh, Minami-san. I didn't know you lived so close. Did what you the? really need to come out? You're Yakushiti-san, our classmate? Wait, no way. Are you two? No. Do you need something from him? It's not what it looks like. This is just... You know... You know... Oh my gosh, everyone just coming oh, in my come house. On in. Pardon my interruption. You are interrupting. And stop. Uh, so this house is still standing. Who are you? My name is Keitaro Miura. Okay, so it's not BJ. So, um, it's kind of complicated, but yeah. I need you to let him stay over for a few days. What? I understand you're Tamao san's grandson. How do you know Minami-san? Come on, I know you have a spare room. Just let him stay until your granny's back. Is my house the exchange? Sleepover house? I won't tell anyone you're living with a girl. That's not... The details don't matter. Just let him stay, alright? Thanks, see ya! Okay, bye, I guess. This just got really weird really quickly. Keitaro Miura. Pardon me. I know Natsuno-san's intentions are good, but... Are you hungry? Why don't you join us for dinner? There goes my simple high school life. Things just keep getting weirder and weirder. High school is never simple. Oh wow, okay, so... Alright, so meta chips obtained 1300, mystery files obtained 3, updated 1, and then archives obtained 1, 22%. Close results. Judo Kurabe's living situation with Megumi Yakushiji is discovered by Nasuno Minami. So he ends up having to accept her request of taking in another lodger. Alrighty then. So we gotta save that.
Alrighty then, so that's all, all the time I have for today. Uh, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, or subscribe. Whatever you want to do. Um, enjoy the rest of your day or your night. And this is Kichigo signing off. Goodbye, everyone.